Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am going to create this makeup look for you. It's an easy glam party makeup look with bronzy eyes and red lips. So if you want to know how I got this look, please keep on watching. So firstly, I'll be prepping my face using this primer from Lakme. So I'll be applying it onto my T-zone and massaging it from inwards to the outwards of my face. Primer helps in giving our face that flawless look so that our makeup doesn't look cakey at all. My next step is to apply the foundation. I'm using this Maybelline foundation and I'll be taking it on the back of my hand and applying it with my fingers. To blend the foundation well into my skin, I am using this sponge from Pack. So once my foundation is nicely blended, I am using this concealer from Maybelline. It's the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. So, I'm applying it around my eyes where I have dark circles. Then, in between my eyebrows, below my cheeks, on my nose and around my mouth. So now, to blend my concealer, I'm using this brush from Nykaa. It's the Nykaa concealer brush and it's a very good brush, just like the Pack and Real Techniques brush. Now I'm setting my face using this compact from Maybelline and it's the Maybelline Fit Me Compact. So you don't have to drag it, you just have to pat it on your face. Now I'll be working on my eyebrows. So I'm using this brow pencil from Nykaa. It's the Nykaa Brow Chica Wow Pencil. So I have just brushed my brows and I'm just filling the gaps that my brow hairs have. Now let's start with our eyes. I'm using this Lakme Absolute Eyeshadow Palette and using that transition shade with my color bar brush. I am now placing that peachy shade onto my crease and blending it nicely so that there are no harsh edges. Now I'm taking that yellowish shade and I'm placing it on my outer V and taking it inwards from outer V to my crease line and blending all the colors nicely. Now I am taking that pressed bronzy pigment and I am applying it on my eyelid with my fingers. After it's applied, I'm using that color bar blending brush again to blend all the colors so that there are no harsh edges. Next, I'm applying this gel eyeliner from Nykaa. So I'm creating a winged eyeliner using this pen. It's a very good pen that you can use for doing that winged eyeliner look. Now let's move on to the mascara. I'm using this Revlon mascara and I'm coating my lashes with it. I'm applying it on my upper lashes as well as my lower lashes. Once I'm done with my lashes, I'm using this brown kajal from Faces. It's the Faces Ultime Pro Mystic Kajal and it's such a creamy kajal. On one side, you have this kajal and on the other end, you have that smudger brush.
Now using this Makeup Revolution Contouring Palette and the Wet n Wild brush, I'll be warming up my face. So I'm taking it onto my brush and applying it below my cheeks. Now I'm taking that blush from the same palette and I'm applying it onto my cheeks. Now I'm taking this liquid highlighter from L'Oreal and I'm placing it on the high points of my face. After it's nicely blended, I'm using that highlighter from the same palette and applying it onto high points of my face. So I'm applying it up on my cheeks. This is just the right amount of highlighter that my face needs because I don't like those highlighters that are too much blinding. So now I'm applying the highlighter on my nose, above my eyebrows, on my cupid's bow. Again on my cheeks because I think my cheeks need a little bit of more highlighting as it was not showing up on the camera. Finally I'm using the slip pencil from Lakme and I'm lining up my lips with it. Now here comes the best part, applying a lipstick. I am using this Colourpop lipstick in the shade Ariba. This is such a beautiful lip shade and I love it so much. So it's a matte finish lipstick and you just need to apply it on your lips and wait for few minutes so that it becomes dry and transfer proof. So now I am almost done with this makeup look. Last step is to spray the setting spray on my face from L'Oreal. So I'm just closing my eyes and spraying it onto my face so that all the powders are melted well into my face. Finally I'm taking that pack sponge and blending all the products in my face. So that nothing looks cakey at all. So guys, I'm now done with this makeup look right here. So this is an universal look that you can wear on any functions either to your college functions or any events that you have you can wear it during the night or during the daytime this look will go perfectly with your indian attire or your western outfits so guys i hope you like this video links to all the products that i used in this video will be in the description box below so please don't forget to check that out Please don't forget to like and share this video, subscribe to my channel. Also please don't forget to press that bell icon so that you get notified every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.